different makeup of your teams, too, when you contrast the women and the men. Right. They have the same roster from last year. You right. guys got a lot of freshman pieces this year. Mm -hmm. uh, describe how uh, the group of freshmen, especially a couple that are playing a lot of minutes, have kind of melded in with your team this year. Um, it's still taking some time. We're, uh, we're all trying to figure out and mesh together, but it's coming together. Usually it, it takes some time with the new team. You know, it takes around first game of conference to figure it all out. So I think we're having the new guys and having them play a lot of minutes early in the preseason will help when it comes to conference because they have, you know, they have that e experience that they had, that they were able to get in the preseason. Now, and you experienced that last year, transfer junior. Right. Now you're in your senior year. Uh, with your first full off season as a Lewis and Clark Pioneer, what do you find your role is this year? Uh, this year, you know, I'm, my shot's falling this year. My first year I kind of had a bad wrist, and it was my shot was a little funky. But this year, you know, I'm knocking down my open threes, and I'm playing with more confidence th than last year. Last year was my first year here at LC, and I didn't really know what coach wanted and how coach was as a coach. So, you know, now I feel comfortable, and coach is asking me to step up and be a leader and always stay aggressive, you know, so. That's my thing this year, being aggressive you know, to score or being aggressive to pass and being aggressive on defense. So that's my role is to, to be aggressive and bring the energy for us. He's Markel Leonard, senior guard for the Lewis and Clark men's basketball team, joining us at halftime of the women's game. Lewis and Clark leading water pack 41-20. You talk about head coach Denari Foreman. There's personalities in this world. <laughs> then there's Coach Foreman. Uh, when you tell uh, potential players for Lewis and Clark, uh, freshmen coming in, when you describe Coach Foreman, what do you mm -hmm. say? Uh, coach is a great guy, man, on and off the court. You know, he, he's a competitor. He wants to win, and uh, he, he, he brings that energy. If we don't have it, he always does. So, you know, if you come in to play for us, you know, be ready to, to defend and rebound because Coach loves defenders and rebounders. And uh, come, we're, we love you here at Lewis and Clark. <laughs> well, and you think about, you know, this team led, you know, the NCAA Division Three in rebounding margin right. just a couple of years ago. So definitely a staple of the game. Uh, goals against Wesley and Wooster to get you set for the Northwest Conference? Uh, block out. You know, they're really athletic, both teams. Um, really athletic. If we keep them off the boards and get ones and outs, I think we'll be in a really good position. Uh, stop them in transition. Both teams like to really get out and run and, you know, just execution. You know, they like to – both teams pressure a lot on defense, so taking care of the ball and executing and making them pay for overplaying and being that pressure team. Over the last decade, Lewis and Clark's been a staple in the Northwest Conference tournament with the likes of Whitman. Right. Whitworth this year has been interesting. Whitman on top right now with Whitworth having a conference loss. How do you assess the Northwest Conference this season? What's important for you guys to be competitive? Um, to be competitive, it all comes down again, is to get in those stops. If we let teams just offensive rebound on us, we won't win many games. So if we can get you know, teams to one and outs and getting those stops and getting out and running, I think that's, that'll put us in contention to make the playoffs this year. Um, executing on offense, you know, taking the right shots, getting the guys uh, in the right position to score and to be successful. But it all comes down to um, rebounding and getting stops. You know, if we can stop teams, we have enough offensive firepower to, to score. 